I'm literally setting up my uh, photo shoot and I wanted to share how I figure things out. I just fucking do them. Look at my light. Spoon caught me. It has all these little knobs to make it go up and down. And I'm going to crawl under there and get a really good close-up picture of my oils that I'm burning today and my beautiful rocks that I'm using to do the work that my body is calling for today, which is calm. So this is my camera to record my behind-the-scenes fun. I'm going to put you right here, and I'm going to check it. <laughs> I think I can see. I think that's better, though, right? Right. Cool. Okay. And then, oh, phone. That's my next camera. <laughs> this one. And then I'm just going to play with my angle of light. And see how it goes as I go. I want it to be super, I want to get the details of the rocks super, um, super clear if I can. So, and I already set them up as I want them, which is, there's always a point behind how they're set up. Like how, usually it's super intuitive about how they come out. And then at the end, it's like, oh, that makes a lot of sense. And at this point, I'm just turning the parts of the rocks to be more beautiful for the um, image but still in the same positioning. This is a, uh, so like, um, I've, I've shared before about like altars and different things and, and how they change each day and floating altars and how like different ones for different spaces. This light's really bright, but just bear with me. So um, today I've gotten, I've received the, uh, the, the notion that I need a really calm day a different day, almost of a vacation day, but but in a super hunkered down in our home kind of a way. So I'm trying to like be super in the moment with the kids, even though I'm feeling a little stressy because like there's super energy right now and I'm just like, please calm, please calm. So, but I, but I feel like I'm doing okay. Like I'm talking out loud and I'm being a little temper tantrum -y, and then I'm calming back down. And then like now I'm taking a break of spoons upstairs with them. And they were settled, and then I'm going to go give them a snack. But anyway, not all that. I'm getting lost in the story. But but anyway, like, this is part of how I check in. So I came down earlier, and I gathered the rocks, and then, then I, I put the oil in the diffuser. Um, so, like, creating the altar itself is a form of a meditation. And then for me, a couple of years ago, when I started this, I realized I do like to take the pictures of them because I just think it's beautiful. And even if you don't believe any of the things that I believe about as far as how they make me feel or how they help me, um, you know, do whatever work I'm doing, you know, that doesn't matter so much. I'm really just sharing the beautiful image and I, I'm happy whatever you take away from it or not, because it, you know, it's just something that I love. So, so that, so yeah, I just wanted to like share in a little bit more detail about another form of meditation after yesterday's first introduction into meditation from my perspective, from my learning curve. And yeah, and then this is just another thing. So this like gathering it, loading it, smelling the oil, which is a new thing to me too. Blair has been helping me with. And this particular oil is from uh, a local business that she's actually closing, but um, Messy Buddha, she was right on the avenue in our neighborhood, like right down the street. So it's like the popular block of the, the neighborhood. You know, there's lots of shops. But I know the business there can be kind of tough. So like, whatever. Anyway, getting lost again. But the point is, um, I really loved being in her store and meeting her husband. And I was with my husband. And I just felt like really calm and really like, oh, these are kind of like, you know, not to say like they're my people, but I just could feel their energy was aligned to what, you know, I, I try to feel and I try, I want for me and my husband, you know, like I love the idea of working together and, you know, and that's what we're working towards. So, you know what I mean? It just felt like, you know, the, you know, this is kind of, this, this will be nice, you know, but at that time I hadn't really learned much into the, uh, the oils and I had only just started using this on like my skin. And today I decided I wanted to use it in the air because I've been doing that more recently as I've been learning into it. So now bringing it all back, I'm taking the image 
And this is all still part of the meditation. I've taken the, now I'm going to take the picture. I've already prepared mentally what I want to say with it. I've actually typed it up and I send it to myself on Instant Messenger. That way I can have it and it's free and I don't get lost in the day and then I feel like it's lost because I love my, when I do that, you know, I think my thing's blinking at me so I might be running out of time. So I'm just going to wrap it up and then I'll take this picture. I'll link, I'll copy and paste it with my words. I'll let it feel and I'm going to like it and then I'm going to share it. And like, it really all is part of just like a thing that I do during the day that doesn't, it like it's it's all a part, you know, like it's not a big one thing. Like sometimes it can be one thing, but usually it's parts, you know, like learning like what's going on. Like it's.